what is parameter binding in ASP.NET Web API. When a Web API calls a method or action on a controller, it must set the values for the parameters. This particular process is known as parameter binding. By default, Web API uses the below two rules in order to bind the parameters. First one is from URI. If the parameter is of simple type, then Web API tries to get the value from the URI. Here simple type mean dot at primitive types like int, double, date time, GUID, string or any type which can be converted from the string type. If you see in the following example, I have created, created a method and that method taking one parameter of int type. So in this case, Web API will try to get the value from URI to set in this parameter. Second type or second rule is from body. If the parameter is of complex type, then Web API will try to bind the value from the message body. So if we see in the following example, I have created a method and that method taking a parameter of student type means complex type. So in this case, Web API will try to get that value from message body. As I have mentioned here already, this is default behavior. So after this answer, and other counter question can be asked, can we change that default behavior? The answer is yes, we can change that default behavior and we can use from URI and from body attributes to achieve that goal. So just remember, use from URI attribute to force Web API to get the values of complex types from the query string. So if you see in the following example, I have created a method and that method is taking student type. And here is a way how we can use that attribute and we can force Web API to achieve this goal. Means get this complex type from query string. Similarly, use from body attribute to get the value of primitive type from the requested body opposite to the default rules. So if you see in the following example, here I'm using that attribute and if you see parameter type is primitive type. But because of this attribute, now we will get or Web API will get that value from uh, message body to set this value. I hope you got the answer.